Brad, not the not the easiest one out there today. Um, obviously got there in the end, thanks to your sensational goal um, at the end. They obviously went down to, to 10 men and I, I think sometimes it could probably be a bit difficult to 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 maybe go ahead when when that's the case. Yeah, it's tough. I think sometimes it's actually harder playing against 10 men than it is 11 because yeah, they got behind the ball and kept a really good shape, Partick, uh, so fair play to them. Um, but obviously it was just about keep probing, uh, get around them, try and get around the shape and obviously we ended up doing that and created a wee bit of space for Hendel, which is a phenomenal strike and then obviously myself to, to get one also was good. I was due it. Yeah, that um, that goal from Henderson was, I think, a long time coming. You guys had a lot of shots, a lot of chances, kept putting the pressure on. Um, obviously, that just kind of gave you guys the, the lift you needed. Yeah, it was a great strike from Hendo, as I said. Uh, I think sometimes you need maybe wee shots in and around at the edge of the box, especially for teams sitting deep and you always try and get uh, around the side. It just kind of pulls them out and, and makes them come out and try and stop shots. And then obviously that's when we gaps open up. But fair play to Hendo, he's, he's smashed it and stuck at the back end of it. And it looked like it was a hard shift out there and maybe credit goes to, to Partick Thistle. I think they actually defended quite well. Yeah, I thought it was a hot day. Um, game came a wee bit sticky, um, a wee bit stop and start, especially in the first half. Um, but no, they're a good side. They're, they're obviously fancying their chances this year also, um, throwing a, a good bit of money at the, at the leagues and they've got a good squad. So um, I think the line will see them obviously do well. Obviously a, a bit of a worrying moment when, when they managed to get the goal, um, being that, that man down. Um, but there seems to be a kind of belief amongst yourself, the, the team, the, the fans, everybody, that even if you go down, you, you're going to get there in the end. And that obviously came through again. Yeah, I think it was a wee bit of kind of on us, try to maybe push and, and seal the game off to make it 2-0 and get caught in the counter. And the boy was quick, the, the, the wee striker that they brought on. So, um, but obviously character in the, in the change room again as, as we've shown over the last year um, it was a good group in there it was just about keep going and we'll get another few chances and obviously we did Thankfully, it's not good. another good backing from the fans as well um, I think they've been looking for a, a new song to sing um, and the, the new one today was about you um, and what a, what a day to sing it what a day for you to get your goal um, obviously that was a, the spark that started the fire for them I know it's the first time I've heard it to be fair um, I like it obviously it's about me so I'll take it um, but no, it's it's been a good a good backing ever since I came in here. Um, I said that when I first came that the fans will be massive for us, and I think it was six and a half thousand something here today. Um, it's incredible for a team that's in the championship, just came up from League One. Uh, so fair play to them. We just need to keep backing us. And um, down at Capital is going to be a tough place to go, especially don't know the weather. It's going to be down there. Um, so hopefully come down in numbers again and, and back us. And just to go back to your goal, um, a really um, incredible strike, um, and. A third assist as well from from Keelan Adams in three games was doing well. Just talk us through it. Yeah, it just came to me, and I, I just and there was one before. I think I took a touch and obviously didn't hit the target. So I just thought, you know, I'll put my laces through it or just hitting it first time. Um, and thankfully this time it went in. I think it was Drew. One had about seven or eight shots today, <laughs> and some of them one of the best, which is I need to, I need to get better at. But um, Keelan's been phenomenal since he came in. Um, obviously. He's kept the eight of the team who's done, who done really well last year and it's just about competition and that's the, that's the squad we've got now. There's People are fighting for places every week and um, he's, he's took it with both hands to be fair to him and he's a great player. And just lastly, I know it's not in the forefront of, of the mind for you guys, um, but that's now 41 games, league games unbeaten, um, going back quite a, quite a stretch. Um, another an, Maybe another season of breaking records in store for us. Oh, I think there's a long way to go. Um, as I said, there's there's really tough places to go in this league. Uh, Capo is one of them. And we're just about taking one game at a time. I think the first objective we need to take off the box is staying in the league. Um, and then we'll go, go for there. Hopefully try and get playoffs and, and see where we end up. Brad, thank you very much. Congratulations on the on the goal and the win today. Thank you. Thanks very much. Cheers, Brad. Cheers.